If Armageddon comes May 21st, as some are proclaiming, this stone house in eastern Tennessee may be a place of refuge. He interpreted the Bible to say that 1969 would be Armageddon, and him and 144,000 righteous people would survive Armageddon and then go on to live for 1,000 years. 61-year-old William Andrew Nicholson built it by hand starting in 1938, living here until his death in 1965. The world escaped Armageddon then. The home bought in 1995 by Dean Fontaine, a firefighter. There's lots of ghost stories about it. Um, they, they say that he, he buried his wife in the walls. I uh, don't have any evidence of that. Piece by piece, room by room, Fontaine is restoring the monstrosity that even comes with a dungeon bomb shelter. Bedrooms are here now. Some are certain Saturday will bring Judgment Day. There's just no reason in the world, no possibility that it will not happen. Dean Fontaine is sure of one thing. He's having a party to celebrate the end of the world at the Armageddon House. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.